I've always been interested in the cultural and religious history of Quebec. I grew up um, with a Catholic background, so I had a, 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 an Irish Newfoundland Catholic background. So it struck me that there were a lot of similarities between my experiences and those of uh, the people I eventually came to study. And the more I, the more I looked at this, the more I was convinced of that. In fact, whenever I tell my Newfoundland cousins what I'm doing, they understand instantly and no one else, um, at least in the English speaking part of Canada, has the same intuitive grasp of that. So I thought this is a, a good um, way to uh, ask questions about Quebec, um, I guess from an outsider perspective, but uh, with a certain sense that we have a few things in common. Um, and I think there's much more commonality, say, in the Quebec religious social experience uh, between Quebec and at least uh, Eastern Canada than uh, a lot of people would uh, suspect. Uh, a lot of Quebec historians look to France for similarities of experience because of the language and the culture and it's quite understandable but it seems to me there's a there's a whole unexplored territory there um, between uh, the experiences I had growing up and uh, people in Quebec. There's a whole a bunch of reasons. Uh, uh, Quebecers were a, a cultural and linguistic and religious minority in the larger Anglo-Saxon world. And it struck me the same thing growing up in Nova Scotia from those roots, that uh, that sense of being a minority, not quite understood by the people around you, uh, is a very formative one. So anyway, I took all of these questions to see if they'd work in Quebec. Um, so the process of historical research meant finding a place that's um, ethnically, religiously homogeneous and seeing if uh, the questions I would ask made any sense in that context. So why did I get involved in Quebec history? An English speaker from the Maritimes living in Vancouver, what are you doing? And somebody kind of in Quebec kind of implied, you're not really going to understand us, are you? Uh, and I thought, no, I mean, that's a legitimate question. But one of my colleagues in Mandarin uh, at Kwantlen, I said to the same thing, look, I teach Chinese history. What do Chinese people think about a Westerner talking about their history? And he said, it's great. It gives a different perspective. We, we allow, we can see ourselves through other people's eyes. So um, that's that would be my answer to people in Quebec. You know, I think uh, this is a fascinating culture. I think there's some uh, interesting uh, human parallels between uh, uh, experiences in different parts of Canada. And um, the other thing is, uh, in nearly 50 years of going there, I've had nothing but the nicest experiences. Lived in Montreal for a while and go back, um, you know, is research in Quebec history going to Quebec City in Montreal a chore? It definitely isn't. It's just a totally fascinating place for me and it always will be.